Hey, what's up, you two? This is the bass guy. Hey, um, since I have a big build, I was actually um, thinking about something. And I realized I needed to do this before um, I actually set up my whole vehicle. All right, now I'm going to show you guys how to use a relay switch if you don't know how to use it uh, to get all your amplifiers running. All right, because the thing with relay switches, um, basically it prevents your source from uh, going out, whether it be your DSP or your radio. All right, so I'm using a relay switch for all my amplifiers. All right, so basically these four amplifiers right here, the two, uh, two 3500s, the sound digital and the massive, and I have the massive 1000.2 right there. I have all those on a relay switch, all right? These two amps right here, my 215Ks, those are gonna go on a toggle switch so I can turn it off just in case I don't need my bass playing or I don't wanna play it. So the relay is only gonna go to those five amps. These two amps right here is gonna go off my toggle switch that I'm gonna set up later. All right, now when it comes to using relays, I'm gonna show you all how you can set it up. Well, the first thing you need to do is make sure that you run all your remote wires to each one of these amplifiers. So basically, you're, you're daisy chaining this remote wire to this one, then connect it to that one, then you connect it to this one right here, then you run another remote wire all the way to the other amplifier, which is this one right here. Now, this is my relay switch right here. I'm gonna tape this up with electrical tape later. But uh, just to show you all, if you look at this relay switch, all right, 87 alpha or 87, that is the power remote. All right, this will go to your battery. All right, the one on the left right here, all right, that is your remote wire. All right, this remote wire right here, that goes, well, that comes from the actual source, which is my DSP. That is the remote, remote out that's gonna turn on everything. All right, so this remote wire, the source wire for the remote, that is where that's gonna go. All right, and that is 86. Now 85, all right, that is the ground wire. That's where you're gonna ground the relay switch. You can use it to your battery or you can ground it itself. Now you have this right here. This is the accessory wire. This is where you daisy chain all your amplifiers at. All right, that remote wire will go to this uh, relay switch right here. So you need to make sure when you're wiring all these amplifiers up, that final remote wire lead needs to go to the accessory switch right here. All right, this basically prevents the remote fused or the remote output right here from burning up, from trying to wire up or trying to turn on so many amplifiers. All right, so that's basically it. Uh, you guys got any questions regarding this? Just, uh, Hit me up in the comments below. I wanna party like Chris Cole.